Carolyn, it's a mystery. They say the only known connection they have is prepared foods, the kind of food you buy here in the deli section. Both of the patients presented with mild to moderate symptoms. Um, they were hospitalized and we expect them to make a full recovery. The alert is to customers who ate prepared foods at the Whole Foods Market during a specific time frame from October the 6th through October the 12th. The deli and the store have not been shut down. Detroit health officials say they are following state and federal protocol. This is not considered an outbreak. They also say no one today is at risk. Anyone who did eat prepared foods here and got flu-like symptoms earlier this month should see a doctor. The high probability is that there will be no further cases from this. If you look at uh, what the science tells us about, um, about hepatitis A cases, most of the time they're sporadic. They happen um, uh, and, and, uh, and there's no fallout from that. Now, hepatitis A is a viral liver disease. It is contagious. Symptoms can last just a few weeks, or they can be severe and last several weeks. Anybody who thinks they might have gotten sick during this time frame should go see a doctor, and that food handler here has not returned to work. Live in Midtown, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right, Jim, thank you for the information there.